Hey guys, it's Tim here, and today I'll be reviewing Flip Guardian, which allows you to sell your PDFs, your eBooks, without needing to have a sales page. Uh, you can also share them for free, as you can see here. This is a, a free one that you can share, uh, but there are many examples. Here is another one, for example, where I show you um, where you can give away a PDF, your eBook, like this. You can let them read for, let's say, eight, nine pages for free, and then suddenly they can purchase the rest of the ebook. So, this is a perfect way to give away value upfront first, and then when people are reading, they want to read more. You can sell it simply through a buy button that appears automatically. Now, you can also lock your PDFs uh, where people need to fill out their email address so that you can build your list by sharing out PDFs. Um, here is another one, an example here. Um, let me see. Yeah, here it's also going to ask for uh, sign up information in order to read the rest of your ebook and all of that can be managed inside of your flip guardian account now let me show you how this works before i do so i want to mention that there is a link in the description of this video it will redirect you to my website where you can see these examples that i just showed you simply uh, click here to try it says here these buttons here simply click on it and it will open the example pages for you um, here is also the pricing details on my page uh, and some extra free upgrades that you're going to get. If you pick this up simply by clicking this button, it will redirect you to the sales page. Um, yeah, and if you pick it up, you will get these bonuses for free. So how does it work? Well, it's super simple. Uh, as you can see, this is my account. And when I click on create new, I can create a new PDF. Now let me zoom out a bit. Um, and here you can upload your ebook. So when I browse here, and I'm going to say here, let's uh, take an ebook here. So this is a uh, pillar that you can sell, for example, Master YouTube Influence. Let's go to upload this ebook. And now I can start sharing it once this campaign is done. So this is simply a PLR product. Now, here at the bottom, you can say allow to download. Yes, they can download the ebook. Allow sharing. Yes, people can share this ebook as well. And here you can say enable preview the first amount of pages. So you can say, for example, they can read the first six pages and then an action needs to be applied. So uh, let me paste here my my campaign, my product name, uh, and in the category, so this is a marketing product. And when I hit save, I can go to the next step here at the top. So basically, we walk through these steps in order to create our ebook. Now, this goes pretty fast. So here it says, what kind of, uh, what kind of campaign do you want to create? So do you want to do one with password access? So that's what you just saw. You can give out a password and then people can unlock your ebook. Do you want to collect leads? So if you want to do lead building, then you can select this one. Or if you want to collect payments like this one, uh, you can set that up in here. So you can say once somebody has uh, paid, you can show them the full PDF or you can redirect them to another URL or an advanced redirect where you can do some more stuff like a redirect URL and a redirect target here. Um, in this case, we're going to show the full PDF. Here you can set the price. So let's say I want to have uh, 2 or $3 for this PDF. I can set that in here or 375 for example i can sell this ebook for any price so the minimum is one dollar by the way now you can also connect this to your autoresponder so all these autoresponders are um, included i'm going to show a screenshot of all autoresponders within a second uh, you can also add them to a webinar software if you like to uh, you can add webhooks zapier webhooks to do some other actions you can add them to product dyno as well uh, send an email after they have unlocked or purchased the product so you can do a send name a from email address a subject name and then you can set your message in here and then on the next page, you can do your styling. So this is the styling of the sign up form, for example. So you can say, I want to have this blue, orange, dark orange. In this case, we're going to do red because we're having a YouTube product. You can say, OK, I'm going to accept the agreements, yes or no. They need to uh, select this yes or no. I'm going to keep this unselected. 
And then on the page settings, you can design the page that they're going to see. So in this case, um, there are some options here. So you could do an SEO page title, an SEO description. Uh, you could set your player skin to dark or light. So in this case, we're gonna do dark. The player background color. Now I like to have this transparent here because then the flipbook will be transparent. And I will show you how that will look like. And then also the page background, you can set this to a color, but I like to have a custom, oh, you could do custom code settings in here. What I like to do here is the background. I like to do an upload of an image in here. So when I upload an image, let me see here in my downloads. I think I like this one as a background image. And let's do that. And, oh, it was bigger than 500K. Let me pause the video. Okay, and I'm back. So let me re-upload that image. It was a very large file. So now I'm uploading this background. It failed. Okay, let me try it again. All right, let me upload here. So I've saved it now. It needs to be under the 500 KB. Uh, otherwise, probably your page will load slow. Now, here you can also add a headline in here. Uh, in this case, I don't want to have a headline. Also, I'm going to delete the sub headline. You can do that so that will appear on your page. Also, a footer text if you like to. Um, but I think I like it the way it is right now. Now, these are some upgrades. So you could do annotations. So you could add multiple annotations. So you could do an avatar here with a background and then the annotation text. And you can create multiple annotations as well as videos. You can add videos as well. This is one of the upgrades. Uh, so let me do save and exit and let us preview our campaign. So... Once your campaign is saved, you will get the URL to your campaign. Now you have several options. You can copy this and paste that in your browser. And this is how your page will look like. So it starts with this beautiful background. And then this ebook will load automatically here, Master YouTube Influence. Now look what happens. We go through the ebook. People can start reading this ebook and they go through. And then when we enter page five, it automatically asks us here to pay 375 so they can unlock this. Now you have other options as well. You can embed this on your website with an iframe. You can make this responsive. You could download this page so that you can upload it to your own hosting. So you can host this on your own URL as well. And you can have export codes as well. I think that export codes uh, allows you to import this into other accounts as well. Or you can save a copy on your computer. And then in here, in your dashboard, you can see exactly here uh, how many views your PDFs got, how many unique views, how many conversions, the conversion rate, etc. And that's how easy you set up these campaigns. Uh, let me show it one more time here. This is your campaign. This is how you can create these beautiful flipbooks. And it looks really beautiful. I encourage you to check out the ones on my website where you can have those links. Um, so yeah, that is what Flipgarden is all about. Now, regarding the integrations here, when we go to integrations, service integrations, you can see that all these platforms are supported. So when people purchase or when people sign up to your list, you can automatically add them to these email platforms, also webinar platforms in here. Uh, Stripe integration for the payments. Um, here, you can choose your country and then you can connect this. And then within the transactions part, you can see all the transactions for, uh, yeah, of people that have purchased your eBooks. And that's basically what FlipGuardian is all about. It's a super powerful platform. Again, you don't need to have a sales page. You simply share those PDFs or those flip books. That's what it's uh, better called. You share those flip books and you can start gathering email addresses, payments. Uh, you can give it away with passwords, etc. So, uh, if this is interesting to you, make sure to check out the link in the description of this video. If you have any questions, make sure to ask them in the comments below. And uh, of course, hit the thumbs up if this video was useful. Consider subscribing to my YouTube channel if you haven't done yet. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next review. Talk soon. Cheers.